Hello dear students of class 4th. Dear students, today we will learn about diameter, radius and code of a circle. And we will solve the questions of exercise 7.1 based on them. So let's start. Students, I have a circular piece of paper and now I am going to fold it. And after folding, what do we get? We get diameter of the circle. Now let's open the paper and see a line segment which passes from the center of the circle and has its endpoints on circumference. And what do we call this line segment which passes from the center of the circle? We call it diameter of the circle. Now, dear students, let's again fold this diameter from the middle. And on folding diameter, what do we get? Students, on folding diameter, we get radius of the circle. So, let's open and see how many radii do we get. Students, we got 4 radii in this circle. And which which? It's OA, OC, OB and OD. Students, if I again fold this circle from anywhere, then what is this? This is the code of the circle. And if I fold this circle exactly from the middle, then what is this? This is also a code and all we know that the line segment which passes from the center of the circle is known as diameter. So it means diameter is the longest code of the circle. So dear students, with the help of circular paper, you have learned about diameter, radius and code. Now let's solve the questions based on it. So students, let's solve question number 1. In the given circle, which are the radii? It's OA, OE, OD, OC, OB and OG. Next, in the given circle, how many and which diameters are there? So, two line segments are there which are passing from the center of the circle. It's AB and EG. Next, find code and in given circle which are codes. It's AB, EG and AF. Students, on folding this circular piece of paper like this, we get diameter. And for radius, we'll fold it again from the middle. It means diameter divided by 2. So what will we get? We will get radius. Students, if diameter of this circle is 6 cm, then what will be its radius? So think and tell. Yes, right you are. The radius will be 6 divided by 2, 3 cm. So this was the case if diameter is given. Then how to find the radius? Now if radius is given, then how will we find the diameter? We will double the radius to get the diameter. It means if we have to find the diameter, then it's 2 into radius. If students, radius is 3 cm, then what will be the diameter? Yes, think if radius is 3 cm, then what will be the diameter? It will be 6 cm. It's 2 into 3 that is equal to 6 cm. And now it's turn for your homework.
Dear students, you have to do question number 1, 2 and 3 of exercise 7.1 in your notebooks. We'll meet in the next video. Bye-bye students.